You did songs with a lot of big artists, bro. Um, a few, a few. How many big artists, bro? Like, uh, from from Cowboy, or I forgot what his name is, Hurricane Chris, I mean, from Tre T Rail. Like, from, from, from what I have in the industry, you seem like you got I've hella connects, bro. What I have and what I've shown is two different things. Oh um, my, so you got a lot of unreleased shit, basically? Yeah, I got a lot in store for sure. Type shit, okay. So that ain't even nothing compared to what you got down there. Okay, so. I ain't so, gonna say like nothing, but. Yeah, it's, yeah. Gonna, it's definitely gonna be bigger, bigger. And yeah, so it's gonna add on to your catalog. That's really what it is. You you creating your catalog right now. Yeah. So how long you been doing music though? I would say all together. All by life. But all type shit. shit. Since I was two, I got video. My grandma got video of me playing the drums. Yeah. Shit. Like I've been doing music my music whole life. I play eleven shit. instruments. You know. You play eleven I, instruments. Yeah. Stop was, the cap, I, Lonely Ben. I was in a band and stuff like that. Um, like from fifth grade. What what kind of, what kind of like you know how to like do the drums and yeah, what like else? Like piano? Cymbal, quad, tenor, bass, I play all of them. Piano? Yeah, I can play piano. So you be singing while playing the piano? Yeah. And you I that cold everything. with it? Yeah, I, I started out reading music like when I was younger, but I play everything by ear really. It how was, do you read music, bro? Them look like little cursive words, bro. Yeah, I, don't, I can't read music. Okay, you, yeah. I just know my basic like, you know. Yeah. Music, I mean, you know what you need to know. Okay, I was like, God damn, I thought you was really in, in that mode. But, all right, bro. So, with me doing interviews, bro, like, where do you see Tulsa music scene? Because it's like, this kind of happened out of nowhere. And it's different people slowly getting to a different level. And people, I know people in Tulsa peeping it. How do you feel like the Tulsa scene is going right now, bro? Man, I feel like they're waking up. You feel me? Like yeah. I feel like it's a lot of ancestral like burial ground out here, you know? Yeah. Certainly in Tulsa, which is an incredible concentration of black wealth, you can look at Tulsa as a tinderbox. Like, what is the spark that's going to ignite it? You know yeah. I mean, it's a lot of, lot of work that the ancestors putting in for us right now. Man, that's how I've been feeling, like, bro. We, we really, we, we made for this shit. Like, they took a lot from us. We, we coming to get it back. We coming to get it back, nigga. On my soul. Okay, so...